All right, so I wanted to spend a quick second talking about normally open and normally closed uh, circuits or normally closed switches. So um, the two different types of switches we're gonna be working with are gonna be these normally open or normally closed. So a normally open will be a switch that looks something like this. And it, this would be for a push button while a normally closed would be something like this. And this will be for a push button too, okay? And it's gonna usually come on the bottom and it'll come up. So if we were gonna be, you know, labeling these things, we would call this one a normally closed and this one a normally open. So N-O, N slash O or N slash C or N-C could uh, determine both of those. Now, what happens is the normally closed is actually creating a closed circuit. So that way the circuit is closed, that way electricity can pass through it. So if I had this switch and it went over here, oops, went over here to a light and then went back up to maybe your, your ground source and over here was, you know, your other, your other side, we would have power transferring through this switch at all times. So that light would be on until somebody pushed that push button to open it. Now our normally open switch up here, if we had a light just like the same, set up the exact same way, it would not come on until that button was pressed. So this is a closed circuit while this one is an open circuit. Same thing if you had a, you know, a circuit put together and you got it cut, it would become an open or even, even that cut area would be considered an open. So these are the two switches you're gonna be working with. I wanted to show you on the trainer how these kind of looked. So one thing that is really important is usually the green ones are considered are open while the red ones are going to be closed. This is not 100% accurate. Don't go off of the color coding. I want you to look at the symbol and I'm going to try to get really close here. And you can see there's a symbol right here on the side. And that symbol is gonna show you a switch, much like some of the ones that we've drawn before. And it's gonna actually tell you whether it's normally open or normally closed. So after watching this video, I want you to actually unscrew this uh, panel and I want you, to, um, want you to actually see what they look like and what those uh, symbols on the sides of those switches look like. So, um, because these right here are actually removable. You can see there's some screws and we can unscrew it. So you can actually take a red or a green button and put a normally closed switch on the back side of it. Also, you can have more than one switch on each one of these buttons. So, and there may be an activity where you're actually required to do that throughout this, uh, this class. So, um, but otherwise, that's all you need to know for right this second about normally open, normally closed. Um, I hope this helps you guys. Please get out there, get some uh, work done on those trainers, all right?